Hello, this is Susan Woods, your Black Lives Matter fraud investigator. Thank you so much for your time. Sharon Osborne is one of thousands of celebrities who gave money to the Black Lives Matter Global Network Foundation in 2020, right after George Floyd died. There was no vetting process in place. Her people didn't try to find out how the organization really worked behind the scenes. She just jumped on the bandwagon with so many other celebrities and just gave money to the Black Lives Matter Global Network Foundation so that she could say that I gave to this Black Lives Matter Foundation. She wanted to be in the number. Well, now she is demanding a $900,000 refund from what she is calling the scam Black Lives Matter Foundation. She's come to realize after listening to comments from Kanye West about the Black Lives Matter scam, now she's saying she's joining a different bandwagon by saying, I want my money back. Well, I say to her, good luck with that. This information comes from The Hollywood Life, and it was posted yesterday um, <clears throat> afternoon at 4.35 p.m by Kelby Vera that was on Friday, October the 7th. And the highlight is, or the headline is, Sharon Osborne demands $900,000 refund from Black Lives Matter after Kanye calls organization a scam. And it says, upon learning Ye, Kanye, had called BLM a scam, Sharon said, well, we gave $900,000 to Black Lives Matter. And I'd like my money back, please. She didn't offer any reasons for her refund request, but shrugged and said, I wish he could have said that before. How, before you give almost a million dollars to an organization, hire some investigators to find out what the organization is all about. How about not jump on the bandwagon just to make yourself look like you care about black people and just give $900,000 without doing your homework. There are so many other black led organizations that would have benefited so much from $900,000 and would have been in a position to give you a return on investment report. Now, Mrs. Osborne, you don't know where your money is. I guarantee you, unless there are lawsuits filed against the Black Lives Matter Global Network Foundation. You won't see your $900,000 ever again. So again, this is just another example of the fraud coming to light that we've been talking about for two years and a half. And I realize that this is old news now. News die a day after it's reported. And we've been, or I've been reporting this as your self-appointed Black Lives Matter investigator for two and a half years now. And I realize it's old news, I get it, but I'm gonna continue reporting until I see some results in terms of someone being held accountable for defrauding millions of people out of $90 million or more. That's what I'm waiting on. So every time I see something, I'm going to try my best to make time to report on it because I am, again, your self-appointed Black Lives Matter fraud investigator. I entered or I added the link to this article in the description of this video. Thank you so much for your time and have a great day.